<laughs> okay, you're probably asking me two things. Afro, why are you still uploading? You said you're taking a break. And the other thing is, what is this video? I'm going to answer both of them right now. I still want to upload. I just do. Like, leave me alone. <laughs> I don't want to take a break until I upload my million subscriber special, which will be done in three days. So we got three videos for show until that happens. And I'm taking a break up until Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Okay? Amen. Now, the other thing. This video, this is like my little filler shit. This is what I do now, okay? I like it. I'm not going to do it after I come back from my break because I'm going to come back with some heavy ammo on your ass. The only reason why these videos come out now is because I, I overall, I do think I am tired from that three-month straight grind of uploading. So there's some days that I, I slip and I don't manage my time as good as I should to produce some heat as I know I could. <sighs> Today, I did want to talk about the million subscriber thing a little bit more, just a little tad bit more detailed, the aftermath of it all, right? I'm sure you're probably asking yourself what happened afterwards? Who hit you up? How is business going for you, right? Does that number mean something still? Because so many people have a million subscribers now. Is that still a special milestone? You're probably not wondering that. Probably not, but hey. Now, for some reason, when I have this conversation in my head, like, or this me explaining it, there's a certain song that plays, and I gotta put in the video. <laughs> it's like, it, it, I hear it right now, bitch. It's weird. It be like that sometimes. But I say that only because uh, normally when I do these videos, there's no music. So, I'm breaking the creed today. Um, literally, right after I hit a million subscribers, a few things did happen that day, but one of the biggest things was just my notifications just ruining my life. <laughs> we did go trending that same day, as I said before, somewhere, and it was a great time, but my phone overheated. <laughs> I tried to, I don't know, just read notifications on my on Twitter, and when I did, the notification sound just kept on going over and over and over, and I got an overheating warning for the first time. I didn't like that. Y'all might have fucked up my Note 10. I don't like, wh why would you do that to me? So many people just, even people I respected I even know fuck with me in that way just just really just shows some love and was, I'll definitely never forget that time out of my whole entire life I, I wrote it down on my phone and everything you know like on full male alchemist Ed had like the pocket watch with that date I have my own load date it was one of a kind man never gonna be able to hit it again so I'm just basking in how it feels I mean I could maybe on another channel hit it but that's not what we talking about um one thing that I think is really interesting is more so how a lot of companies are approaching me now it's humbling as fuck. It's just blessings on blessings. It just kind of shows, which I'm letting you know the cheat codes. A lot of companies do view your subscriber count over how much views you're getting. Some do, you know, look at views, but um, who you are, your name, the weight, what you've accomplished has a greater weight in business than, you know, your views. Because views come, they go. But what, what do you got that lasts forever? Do you got the sauce? So I don't want to get too deep into that because I don't really know what's going to happen. But if things are looking as true as they looking in my DMs these next past few months, we're going to see a transformation with maybe what I'm doing here. Like I'm doing the same things, but I would love any assets for me to have my vision of making content that much more clearer, stronger creative -er. <laughs> um, to me I look at content creation like a video game uh, you know I play games on my channel and stuff but the game of YouTube is one of a kind it's the longest game I've been holding on to the, the most consistent thing that I've been doing in my life it, it's it's a journey man um, I think one of the craziest things for me that's still very surreal is growing up with you guys. You know, so many of you guys have come and told me, like, you watched me since Storm, which was in 2016. Used to be in high school. Now you're in college. Now you're doing this. Now you're doing that. You know, I used to be in the hood. Now I'm here fat. <laughs> I'm going, we're going to lose this. Shit. Trust me. This year. This year. All right. I'm no more nipples. Hashtag no more nipples down below. But, um, nevertheless, it. It's so surreal, like how fast time goes. Maybe not for you, but like for me, it feels just like yesterday when I moved up my own a little bit. Like really, I, 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 want, I can't stress this enough, man. Please savor the time that you got with the people that matter the most. Um, that's one of the reasons why I do take this break too. You know, just definitely kick it with those set people that, I, that I'm talking about. Now I'm gonna come back, we're gonna master this daily upload and shit, and it'll be GG. I don't know, man. It, it was a really crazy humbling experience. The person who I was prior to a million, like my viewpoint, my view perspective, definitely did change a lot. Like this goal, getting to where I'm at, not only changed my work ethic, my, my, my thought process to, you know, getting what I want out of life, like how I got to obtain that, but it also changed my outlook on just the importance of happiness and keeping things in check. And uh, maybe that's something you really understand when you're older, but I guess the sooner the better. You know, make use of the time that you have. You, you never know what's going to happen tomorrow, of course. I'm not saying, like, grind all in one night. 
to try to make your dreams come true but it's even in the smaller things like make the most out of life man i don't i don't want nobody to you know go out of here unfulfilled do what you got to do and spend it who you got to spend it with but do it responsibly don't be on some crazy shit. but that's pretty much all i got to talk about tomorrow we'll come back stronger with what i was trying to do and um this might be the last filler video you'll see for a while because after you know i get all my shit situated we get the mini subscriber special out and take my break i got some ammunition for that ass so we'll see what happens then but um as always i hope you guys have a good one and uh take it easy